Hello and welcome to MIP TV. Um, we are doing a series called Meet the Trainers where we speak, or I speak, to the people who train um, and work at Manchester Institute for Psychotherapy. So I'm delighted to welcome Susie Hewitt, who's one of the trainers at MIP. And just in the preamble, before we press the record button, Susie was telling me you actually trained at MIP. I did. Um, 2007 to 2011, I did my four-year TA training. And what what do you think helped? How do you think it helps you as a trainer, having trained at the institute? Well, lots of training institutes um, in the country have different styles and different cultures. And when we think organisationally, it's important to know as a trainer the culture and ethos of the organisation you're training for. So it's great to, to know Barbers as a trainer and personally and understand how his institute works, having been on the receiving end of it as a trainee. So it's great to come back as a trainer and uh, sort of slot back in to the way that it should be. Yeah, so you're fitting in with the ethos of the organisation and hopefully training in the, in the way that you've been trained, in the ethos that you've been trained, sharing that along the line a little bit. Now, you said earlier that you were PTSA, is that correct? Yeah, there's, there's one letter missing. Oh. It's a P, PTSTA, which is a Provisional Teaching and Supervising Transactional Analyst. Yeah, and I think that's really important, isn't it? Because what perhaps may be not wider, wider known is that you have to be an accredited teacher to teach TA. You cannot, like I've got a cert ed, I've got a certificate of education, but that wouldn't allow me to go and teach transactional analysis. It just goes to show the kind of quality that goes into TA training, really, doesn't it? It does, yeah. And um, in order to clock up your TA training hours, you need to be trained by a PTSTA or a TSTA, yeah. So that is a real difference. And I'm, on, I'm sure that might surprise some people who watch this, that actually the, the whole of the, the system of TA is built around sort of quality assurance, uh, from supervision to the training to the actual kind of theories, there's a whole kind of system in place. Yeah. So, got any favourite? Got any favourite theories? What's your favourite theory? All traders have a favourite bit of theory. What's your favourite bit of theory? My favourite bit of theory is uh, is going to be TA because you know I've had eight nine years of training in TA. It's stroke theory. It's about the stroke economy um, that Claude Steiner. Um, came up with and invented um, all about how he says we can deal with the critical parent and turn the volume down on the critical parent in our head and manage anxiety and depression through making sure that our stroke bag is full well there we go and i'm going to add to that susie as we finish this interview thank you so much for taking the time and um, i'm sure that the students students in the future watching this will get so much out of it susie Hewitt. Thank you very much. Thanks, Rory.